I now got to bring it into the game to the screen. Uh, hello? Can I not use game character with this? I can't use game character. Oh, oh, there we go. There it is. Wait, since when can I use game character for this? I remember that I had to use window capture or browser capture or whatever. And it had like a big, the big yellow border on it. And now I don't need to have it. I guess they fixed it. Maybe they fixed something in the game. Also, I guess I'm going to say this, but uh, I did play a little bit of the game off stream just so that I could do like playlists and stuff like that. And here's the thing. I ended up getting all the way to soul face rank three. And um, I did one event. I claimed all of these. Uh, where is it? Not that, not that, not that, not this. Is it this? Am I supposed to do something here? Oh, I need to do both of these. <clears throat> I don't know what this is. But it gets me stuff, so I guess I'll do it. Core cleansing. I did try this. I'm not done with this. Oh, I guess it's gone because I already completed it. Or maybe it's because the, the event ran out of time. There was a small uh, event with like a, a hamster kind of character and you had to do a bunch of like random um, chores. Very, very small chores um, to get some like lottery rolls. And I did that event. I skipped the first part of it, but uh, after a while I noticed that it doesn't have like any sort of like important story. So I started reading it. There wasn't much to it, but it made me run all the way down here. I had to unlock this area in order to be able to to see where I was going or like to teleport in case it told me to go back here. So I unlocked this area. I unlocked this area as well, all the way over here. I haven't gone through this uh, area. I don't know what this is. Between battle simulation? I don't know. I'm going to ignore it. I think I ended up unlocking this area as well. Unlock this both of these waypoints. And I think I unlocked another area over here up north. Okay, maybe I didn't unlock an area up here up north, but I did um search up this area and I ended up unlocking all these uh little teleport points. Alright, and I also fought this guy. Uh he was pretty easy. <laughs> uh I did mention before that I actually fought some very high leveled enemies. They didn't have much HP, but they hit very, very hard. So custom mark, what does that mean? Um, so I think I've been doing really well with the game. I think I still, uh, I got a little, the hang of how to play this game a little bit more, especially because I watched a couple of people play, not through the story because I didn't want to spoil myself, but I did definitely see some people play, you know, like the game in itself. Uh, they had a couple of like new characters. For example, uh, Arrow knows this person because uh, he's been using her emotes because he gifted a software uh, to him. Um, Boba uses... <sighs> what are their names? Is there a way to see the, the names of characters? Tutorials, trophies, gallery? Crossing stars? Okay. Yeah. This is the person that I wanted to like start the game and the gotcha four but uh, there were only like two days left before she was gone and then i laced around uh so i didn't even get like a single 10 pull on her um but if i remember correctly boba uses zeji jinzi and i think she also had a team with shiny yo I think that's it. Oh, and Verena as a healer. Those were the teams that uh she had, or like the, the characters that she had. And I watched a little bit of her how she played the game, and I think I got a little bit of like understanding as to how to play the game. I feel like my sensitivity is trash, man. I don't know what to do with it. I feel like it doesn't move fast enough. Like this is super slow. I have to drag my mouse in order for it to move. And I'm already at 95% for this. Like look at this. It's 95. Screw it, I'm going at 100. So yeah, uh, I also did this. I don't know if I can teleport to this. I cannot. 
But uh, so far, I think I'm going to continue with the story. At the very least, I'm going to do a little bit of the story because I don't have that much time left. I have like 40 minutes left. Maybe I'll only do 30 minutes. Hopefully, I'll finish this story. And here's the thing that I was surprised about. Before, I was thinking, oh, man, I am not going to be able to. I need to complete the story in order to be able to get the dailies. Well, would you look at that? My dailies are unlocked and I haven't continued anything on the story. I just needed to level the fuck up. And I couldn't do that. I was too dumb to do that. Man. Uh, if only I knew. I could, oh, if I knew that by leveling up, I was actually going to unlock the, the dailies. But I guess like the, the place that I actually looked it up on uh, just like had flipping misinformation as usual. And it was like the first thing that I saw on Google. So I'm, I'm kind of mad about that because I'd continue playing the game or at the very least doing the dailies if I knew that I could unlock the dailies just by leveling myself up by doing some exploration. That's about it. Pretty mad about that. It's just false fast travel over here. Now, if I remember correctly, the place where I stopped playing was literally at the top of that rock, I think. Healing complete. So right now, my team is uh, Rover. What's her name? Encore and Verina. This is my current team. I think I'm liking it. The main reason why I'm using Rover is because uh, I was able to ascend him really, really easily. And I can also do the next ascension if I, you know, find whatever the hell this is. I have to look it up later. For her, I need to farm this. And this, I got it yesterday. Um, on like the gift thingy in the city. She is this one the souvenir store that's where he got it from either that or this place the relic merchant oh this is a big guy this is one of the big guys that i was talking about oops so these guys are supposed to be really really tough oh well at the very least i didn't get one shot Okay, okay, okay. Maybe I screw up a little bit. Every now and then. But I can still fight really, really well. And I usually do this. And swap. I do nothing. Because I forget that that doesn't do anything. And that's why I usually deal with these big enemies. Now then, I think I'll heal myself up back up. I kind of screwed up on that fight. Here we go. Healing complete. Grab that snail. Because I don't know what it's going to do. And then there's a... I, I thought this... This type of like big enemies were supposed to be just like once... Uh, they only spawn once. And they were supposed to be like super, super rare. Or just like a challenge kind of enemy. Uh, but it looks like they respawn. So, there's another big enemy up here. Right at the top of this uh, cliff. He's said like at the tip right here. He's like this like stone enemy. This type of enemy. Oops, that's the wrong button. This type of enemy. And he was tough because he kept one-shotting all of like my characters. Oh, and all the enemies are now level 45. I don't care about meteor dodges. So this is usually how I play the game. And as you can see, that it works pretty damn well. I don't know if I'm playing it right or wrong, but screw it. If it works, if it ain't broke, don't fix. And I'm killing enemies, so I guess I'll just keep playing this way. I don't even know if my team is good. I know at the very least that I have a DPS, a healer, and a support type of character. Because Grover is a support type character. But I don't know if it's good enough to be... Like a proper support. Before him, I was using Yang Yang. Because if I remember correctly, it says Comet Roll. She gave energy regeneration, and I thought energy regeneration was going to be important for her. Because she has like a an install ult. But uh, at the same time, I don't know. Her install ult served just like. Um, 
I know they're not doing much with it. Like, I go into it, I do a couple of attacks, and then I do the charge attack, and then I switch back onto, like, Rover, and I start doing stuff with Rover. I wonder if there's another, like, support that I can use. Are you a support? I got her on one of my free rolls, and of course she was free. Basic attack, damage, amplification. And you... Havoc damage amplification for specific teammates. Havoc damage amplification. I don't have a Havoc character, so I guess I'll just ignore it. Anyway, story! Wooden Plague, right. Restore Wooden Plague. I restore Wooden Plague with mysterious carvings. Do you remember seeing a socket where it could fit somewhere before? I cannot remember where it was supposed to be socketed in. I'm guessing it's down here. Yeah. Thanks, game. You can place a wooden plague on the stone. Soon after, you hear the blah 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 blah. The roaring of the wind? Welcome back, Arrow. Hi, King. <laughs> Enter the cavern. I think... True. Hmm... I was gonna say, all right, I saw that on the map that there was like this area that I needed to unlock and apparently I needed to complete this like ominous star quest. And I think this said something. Oh, here, it's the ominous star quest. I just need to complete this in order to unlock all uh, this entire area. And this was all that I was missing. Anything to explore? I don't think so. What is that? Does that hurt me? Nope. Okay, I guess. You know what else is eerie? This thing that looks like a person getting impaled by a stone? Yeah. Oh, I do remember this. Hearing like a tacit discord. Or hearing something say, please save us, please save us. It was also one of like the little onion guys. Oh, this thing. Oops. Accidentally skipped it. I've seen a lot of these statues, and I don't know what the hell they are. They're creepy. I can't destroy them. I think it's... Oh, it's gone. I'm gonna guess this is an effect of the area. Because it's supposed to be near this, like, Discord thingy. Alright, time to read. Oh my god. This is a lot to read. <laughs> <clears throat> June 19th. Today a strange man came to our village. He said to call him brother, if I didn't mind. He was really friendly, but for some reason he seemed different from the people in my village. He seemed to know a lot about me. Even telling me that we were of the same kind. He told me a really strange fairy tale. The ending of the fairy tale was kind of scary, but reality was even scarier, he said. He then asked, what would you do if you were the little black lamb? So I'm going to guess that this big brother that she's talking about is Scar, because Scar told us the story of the little black lamb. Before I could think of a reply, he had already left with a cryptic, see you next time. I told father about it, but he said no one like that had ever visited our village. Who could he be? July 20th, a month after the first entry. Sorry, I'm so sorry. Smudged water stains. If only I weren't so weak, I could have driven away those tacit discords. If CC didn't have to protect me, there must be a way. Father said that I can manipulate the frequencies of tacit discords and humans. CC, I'm so sorry you look like this now. It is only temporary. I'll do everything I can to return you to the way you were before. I know you can still hear me. Father promised me he'll surely find a way to help. December 17th. About five months. I think it's five months after that. It's been three months since that incident. Five or six months. 
Father doesn't seem to remember I'm still keeping a diary. He gave me the notebook to me, but if he found out I'd been writing about everything, he'd be so mad. He wants me to do uh, what he says and use my power to recombine frequencies of tacit discords. But if anyone finds out about the truth, that Cece, who went missing, actually died trying to protect me, and then I turn him into a horrifying tacit discord, they will see me as a monster. I will be banished, and no one will ever understand or accept me with what I can do. No one except him. Probably Scar. But will the dead really come back through frequency manipulation? And if so, what would happen to the shattered souls trapped inside their new bodies? I really don't know. February 8th, two months. Every day I feel more and more uneasy. The people in the village are disappearing, and those stats of discord the father has brought back. I can shake the feeling that something is very wrong, but I am trapped, like a moth to a flame, unable to escape this dark path. I don't know what my father did. It must have been something terrible for the tension in the knees here. I am not allowed outside anymore. And when I ask why, he just brushes it off. If the price for my wish to come true is more bloodshed, I... No date. The villagers have surrounded our house. They must have learned about it all. The murderer. Is, is that what they call me now? Or perhaps my father too? At this point, what difference does it make? After all that has happened, can someone come and save me? If I must pay the price for... Kichi? Chichi? Village. If there is a god, I hope they can. Save my village. At the end of the last diary entry, you see a message in another handwriting. It seems you are the luckier one. Huh. And that was probably Scar. I'm betting. And because she was just a little girl, she was manipulated by the adults, adults, her father. Hmm. I can't remember. I think this is supposed to be colder because we're like, you know, underground and there's a lot of humidity due to the water. Yep, Japachino. Indeed, Japachino. Are you able to write the, read the tiny notebook that's close to the edge? It shines. I'm gonna check as soon as I'm done with this like little scene. Cause it won't work for me. Wait, do you mean the notebook that I literally just read? Or is it another notebook? Another one. I'll check in a second. Also, hi, Jungle Escape. Spade. I'm sorry. <laughs> Too much japping, and I'm trying to like read things very, very fast. I still can't tell what this whole thing is about. Why did Scar tell me that story? Why did that, that tacit discord show up? What were they trying to tell me together? What happened to that village? And this. And who was Chichi? Or Sisi? I don't know what the pronunciation would be for her. If I remember correctly, there's a war going on currently in this world, so there's a lot of tragedies that might end up happening. Hmm. Stop the lament. I think it's better to say I'm with you rather than I trust you. <laughs> ah! Oops. <laughs> it's the second time that I act skipped accidentally. Because I think they already finished with their dialogue. 
Do not drag me back to the city. I gotta check a notebook. Do not? Okay, good. Oh, this was the end of Act 3. I mean, I was really close to it. Reach Union Level 11? Didn't I already reach Union Level 11? In the guide you I'm level 21! <laughs> Brother, I'm 21! What are you- What are you telling me to get to level 11? Uh, complete the quest to claim activity points. Ah, I guess this is why that page told me about it. This is the tutorial for the dailies. Except I already had unlocked dailies like, I don't know, a week ago. Ah, I'm barely off. Co-op mode. You're getting sleepy, Aero? Much love, Aero. Thanks for coming by, as always. I hope you have some nice eeps. Right now, let's see. Stay back. Brother, do not... Wait, answer? Hey, sub see there. Yeah, so... You know how there's a bunch of people that were talking about 1.3 and how good the story was? I heard about that, too. And I suddenly just got into, like, a... a I, I never wanted to abandon this game, but it just got way too busy. And now that I'm way more free, and now that I'm not literally the only worker at, uh, at like, you know, work, at my workplace, doing, like, literally everything that, that, that is need to be done uh, at work, I have a lot more free time. I'm able to come back home, like, earlier. I'm able to just do more stuff. So now I'm able to get back into the game. Yeah, I've seen uh, little bits of, like, combat for the game. I've seen characters. I watch your streams, either. Uh, what playing uh, Wuwa? So I've seen the, the things that this game like has, like the combat, like the animations and stuff like that. But first things first, I gotta watch and play the story for myself. I gotta see with my own eyes what the 1.3 story is all about. I'm probably not gonna be able to get uh, the events done because I still need like a lot to do. Like, I, I'm, I'm probably still on 1.0 uh, quest. 1.4 is going to make this game explode. When is 1.4? Is it soon? Mm, I wonder if it has to do with what happened on the village. In one week. Damn. Stories like this are always so damn creepy. Mm. Actually, see there wasn't Chiktia, one of your mains at the start. Chameleon, I'm pretty sure 1.4 is the console port update unless they pushed it back again. Hmm. Camellia, I think I did see her stuff on Twitter. It's the uh it's the girl that has like the flower on her chest. I think that's the character. I like her tomboy type of like uh tomboy types of characters and she fits the uh the tomboyish kind of like girl really really well. You received a message right after hanging up with Chichia. Solitary visitor in Jinzo, the Shan Society. Feeling weighed down by the burdens of the past that you cannot share? Is there someone beloved you wish to uh, see again? We, the Shan Society, understand your pain. As we all carry regrets of lost loved ones, join us. We offer a solution. Coordinates shared. Ah, for sure. Totally not suspicious at all. Companion story. Oh, I see. I teach at solo the level 120 bear with her at 40. Okay, yo. All right. Notebook at the edge. Notebook at the edge. Uh, yeah, I can't. I can't interact with the notebook. Sarah, do you know anything about this? Dreamless Spade was asking uh, if I could interact with this notebook, and they said that they couldn't. And I see that I can't interact with it either. Is this bugged? 
Is this not supposed to be interactable? Is this part of like a uh, a quest that you need to do in order to unlock uh, this little notebook? Flashing blades. Act four. This is it. It's a side quest. Oh, okay. There you go. Uh, Dreamless Spade. Cedar has played this game a lot. He loves this game. I don't remember which though. That's good enough. I mean, knowing that it's actually not a bug and it's just like uh, locked by a side quest, it's more than enough. All right, let's teleport over. Normally, I'd walk over there, but uh, probably explore all the area between that. Try to go. Thundering Memphis is amazing for practice encounters, by the way. Thundering Memphis. Is it that enemy there? Tempest Memphis. Or is it the guy over here? Crownless. Nope. Who is Thundering Memphis? Who are you? Oh, here. This guy. I'll probably run over there and farm them uh, for a while later. I do need to find... Rover's speed rate is increased by 15% for 7 seconds with casting resonant skill. Resonant slashes of resonant skill resonate spin. Sure. Uh, are counters the ones that you parry? The ones that you actually hit? That you got a time? If I remember correctly, Crownless has a bunch of those that I've been doing. I do counter only funds just to practice counter timing on him? Yeah. I'll check him out later. Probably off stream when I need to use my weight plate consumption. But uh, I noticed that right now there's this though so i gotta use this five days remaining because i finished that somehow what else have i done i wish i could have pulled for her man she's very pretty <laughs> i wish i could have pulled for her it's so sad you have her of course you do i never doubted you having her it, it, it feels like right now, so far, you, we're pulling for, like, every character. Either every character or every, like, uh, pretty character. On SN character, you only dodge one character in the game right now. Oh, thanks for the follow, Dreamless Spade. Who? Who did you actually not pull for? <laughs> the Artist Lady. Isn't, isn't she, like, pretty good? Uh, I think her name is... Yinji? I think that's her name. No, that's not. That's the dragon lady. Sinchi. I think it's Sinchi. Oh, you told Shisha about your findings in the Sorok Highlands and Chichi Village. All right, this guy's a very, very weird name. Fraxidius. Fraxidus. Gigi. I wonder if it's Gigi. Chinese is so tough, man. Those <laughs> Hmm. I can't remember if they have out already given the lore for resonators as to why they are like the privileged ones that have been given this power to fight against the tacit discords. If they mention about it, then she's kind of mid, though. She's a DPS that doesn't hit as much as I'd like her to. She's pretty much all mobility. Mm. I did see someone that plays the game play with her, and that she spends, like... When she ults, she spends, like, 80% of the time, uh, like, mid-air. Because she has, like, that special skill, that, like, teleportation skill with, like, a grappling hook. Kind of dingy. Mm. Isn't Scar like a very big fan favorite? 
because it's like the the cool dude kind of character. I'm surprised that he hasn't become a character yet, and instead we're getting like a. Uh, the uh, the flower lady, she has like red clothes. She's part of the this guy's right. The what are they called? Scar banner is planned. Yeah, but enough characters are idle at this point, but it's not worth notating. Mm -hmm. I wonder how. Do ca I does this game have some sort of like philosophy in terms of like the characters that are going to become like banner characters? Maybe this is going to be a little bit spoilery for me, but uh, do they become allies? And is that why you can pull for them? Because I know there's games that uh, you can pull for like enemy characters and stuff like that, or characters that are not allied to you. Nah, okay. So he may still be like the, the bad guy, but you can still like pull for him and just play as him kind of thing. Because I really don't know much about, like, you see that this is still, like, 1.0 story. So I'm still, like, uh, lacking a lot of information. I'm lacking critical information. He's always going to be a bad guy. Oh, damn. Uh, there's some people that are going to be very happy about that. Scar's not available yet. Yeah, um, Cedar mentioned that he's going to be, he's, like, a planned banner. So he's probably going to come in the future. Who knows when? Who knows? Maybe if he's popular enough, he might become a anniversary character. Because you know how uh, a lot of gacha games like to put uh, very popular characters on their anniversary banners uh, to just to drag m uh, more attention to the game. Just, um, what's the word for it? Uh, marketing. Marketing plans is like way far away because he's not in any leaks until 2.2. 2. That is, that is very, very far. That is indeed very, very far. Because either you just mentioned that we're barely getting into 1.4, right? I think there was another sort of like bad character that showed up. I can't remember who it was, but it was when we were living, leaving the uh, the city, and she was like on top of like a tree. I can't remember who it was. Yeah, but after 1.4 is 2.0. Whoa, wait, okay, oh, okay. Man, that's a jump. <laughs> okay, never mind. It's not that far off. <laughs> and that, that really surprised me. That's related was Camellia. Ah, okay. There we go. There's the answer. And Camellia is the next character, the next banner on uh, 1.4 and then 2.0. So what's the special thing about 1.0? I'm sure you already have like this information either. What are they going to bring into the table for the game that they're calling it 2.0 that they're already like jumping from 1.4 to 2.0 camilla is a good guy but she's like the crazy ex-girlfriend oh yeah i could tell from like the little interaction and she's like crazy for like rover already going uh, giving the full gender vibes new country i see new area type of thing mm. あの村でそんなことがあったとは思わなかった。連絡を受けてからすぐ治安署で事件について赤い情報を調べてみたんだけど、現レインが着任する実と前に後処理も記録もとっくに済んでたよ。うんうん。その後は安心して。犯人は
Or maybe it's the other way around, he was trying to lead me? One or three. One of these two. Scar wanted to preach his ideas to me. He definitely wanted to say something to me. And then he had to disappear. But if we go for the full conspiracy route. Then the magistrate maybe knew that it was going to happen. Let's go for this. So, so far, what I'm catching from like the lore of this game is that you, Rover, were here in this world a very, very long time ago, and you did something very, very special, which I cannot remember what it was. Uh, and now you came back with no memories. And that's like what's going on right now. Currently, as there's a war going on against the Discord. Like Tacit Discords. Actually, I don't even know if I'm pronouncing the thing correctly. Is it Tacit? Is it Tacit? I don't know. I'll probably Google it later. <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> Tacit? Okay. Thank you, Dreamless. Oh, by the way, just so you know, uh, English is not my first language, so that's why I may have like some difficulties and why I may have a sort of like accent going on. Uh, her token was a warning that the fractures had their eyes on you. Mm. Jinsu's way of hospital, remember? In Game of Weichi, when the black moves, why is sure to follow? Hmm. It's cool, no worries, I'll help. Thank you, Dreamblast. So I'm guessing you're a big fan of Wuwa. Have you already caught up with the, like, the whole story and thing? What did you think about 1.3? Would you say that it also was like a banger of a story? Of course! No spoilers. <laughs> Please. If something happens, I want to play through it. I want to be excited about it. I want to scream and I want to cry. By the way, if there's a, a scene that there is like cry on uh, 1.3, I will 100% cry because I'm a, I'm a flipping crybaby. <laughs> I'm a bitch. I ain't gonna sugarcoat it. Yeah, I've been playing since Relita and I'm obsessed. Nice. Renodian. 1.3 stories controversial. I won't spoil why, but personally, I loved it. Hmm. The only thing I know about 1.3 <clears throat> is one that is all about Shorekeeper, and two, I watched a little bit of uh, on the Weather and Waves YouTube. They posted an MV. I watched a little bit of it, but then I noticed that the MV might be having a little bit of like spoilers, so I stopped watching it. Uh, but that's all I know about 1.3. Who am I? I don't know. You tell me, Yan Yan. Sure, sure, keep her my love, but yeah, we just have spoilers stay away. Yeah, I'll try. <laughs> and the thing is that I, I wasn't sure if I was going to get back into Wuwa because of the thing that I mentioned that I was just like way, way too busy. Like, literally, uh, normally they're supposed to be like two or three like workers workers at my workplace and we ended up losing uh, all of the other workers and i was like the only one there so i had to do like everything i had to like uh go over to to my workplace like early i had to come back home late i'd be all tired uh and tired from like work and then after that i like to like go and watch other vtubers and support them and their streams would end up like uh starting soon after i was done like eating my lunch and i just have like no time for like gotcha or like to keep on playing wuwa in general so i had to just like cut my gotchas in like half um it was a very sad time because i love my gotchas this game can drain you for real glad you have time yeah now yeah same I am your friend. The one you know as Rover. Nah. 
I have a real identity. Mm, the time at the academy and the direction in Chichi village. Way and Vermilion Bird. Try what? The sundial? Okay. Time. A chichen of way. さあ。ひどけの中央に四角の方位が記されています。それを自信に合わせたら完成ですね。東の勢力、西の逆光、南の。ブルミレンバルドオブザウス。南の原部。何度も強調された方位は。うん、this one. Okay, so this is the last message that the magistrate has for me. This is the location of the Shinso's, Jinso's Grand Library. Oh. Uh, why should you? Maybe, but maybe she wanted it to be super secret, then she might have, like, you know, hidden it better. Since, you know, she's supposed to be super smart. Hmm. Nothing new. That's crazy. They hold all the answers to all questions one could ask. <laughs> He's very happy about it. Nanode, <laughs> アクセス権限を他の人に付与することができるのですが、実際に行ったことはほとんどないそうです。うん、うん。検定のデータの金庫みたいだね。そこで得られる情報は正細かつ正確なものです。The thing that I'm already suspecting? Okay, and the second one? Already pretty obvious? <laughs> oh no until we find out who the hell I am I am I'm still thinking that I'm that they, they when I started the game they talked about a little legend which also had something to do with like the uh like taking over or like absorbing the tacit discords or like absorbing echoes 
So I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be that character from that legend. That's my idea so far. Hmm. It looks like our uh, our character has uh has some doubts, some ideas. My that mansion wishes to meet me alone. I'll need to go somewhere on my own. Oh uh... Keep it a secret, tell them, or just give them a little bit of information on it. I think I'll just go for this one. I think the best option here is just to reassure them. Alright, Act 4. Clashing Blades. So, Grand Library route map. Um, just need to head all the way up there. Can I use this? I guess I can, very handy. Oops. Oh, I had to go through the inside. Up. Yes. Set up. Take me up. I guess now the only thing that I had to do is to find out where 1.1 starts. Like the story of 1.1. Surely the 1.0 qu uh, story didn't end on the last quest that I did. Uh, I'm in the stars. Maybe it ends after this one? After 1.4? Uh, it's called 1.4. One four. Enter City Hall. Top left corner of the map carries a highlight mark. This may indicate the location of the puzzle. Uh, right here? Or here? Not here. The base. I think I heard a low grumbling noise. That to be a dragon. Enter the Grand Library. Recommended character level 40. Ah, oh, okay. Sure, I guess I'm just gonna have to fight something. Jinso is the home of one of them to one of the Huang Long's unique database centers managed by the Sentinel and controlled by the Jinso magistrate. Uses time as an index and precisely records information related to the city's establishment, making it a comprehensive and objective resource. The class books of Jinso, stored in the city hall, hold important data collected since the ancient times. This vast database holds answers to any questions, to any question one may have about Huang Long's history. I think I just go with the same team that I have. I still think that this is going to be like a lot of like very tutorial-y or like very easy fights, so I don't think I'm going to have to go very meta-y at the very least yet. So I'll just go with the same team. And I do want to keep Rover on the team and just like sort of like have the uh, the main character, the quote unquote main character, just like always on uh, on screen. Well, at the very least, if it's on the portrait here. Ah, uh, yes, a puzzle. Pretty good with puzzles. Gather five tones for line in tune. The bells shall guide your path. Find keynotes to determine tone. The archive shall be unmasked. Probably this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay. 
欠けている音の一つによって、うん、装置に入れてみよう That's one Top left one やっぱり精密が灯されたそっちの流行を鳴らせるようになったみたいだ Here we go 水の下から昇る流昇鐘を鳴らせとはこのことか OK I see OK so I need to connect it to the another one of these 一つ目の謎は解けたようだ次はそっちか That was weird though This thing showed up like the energy bridge showed up very very slowly Any treasure chest? Any loot? I was gonna wait for the dialogue to finish. It's something that you learn playing video games for a very long time. But sometimes it skips stuff. Multiply 54 with four thirds for the frequency you seek. Find this note in the west while the prophet is beyond reach. Good question. I have no idea. The West over here. Oh, I see. Can I interact with this? Yep. Yes. Okay. Let's get some more stuff. Let's go back to the base. Chang. Bottom left, and the water goes down. By a lot. Damn. Okay, so this is what I want to use. One more. Oh, this one looked better. I wonder why the other one didn't actually load in time or load fast enough. Okay, if you say so. Hmm. Oh, am I supposed to get over to that chest? Is that the idea? It's not locked though. I can just do this. But it opens this door here. I does give extra loot. All right, I don't mind that. I just need one more chest, and I'll be the next level. Yeah, this is what I was talking about. Never do things too fast because you'll end up missing some dialogue. Oh, this should be it. Oh, 23. Right. Ah, it went the wrong way. I'm gonna have to hit it three times. There we go. 
Even though I probably could have jumped on this. One more. Now, where is the last one? All the way at the bottom. Oh, maybe this is the last one. Right here, the golden one. It said that I needed to be level 40, but uh, these guys are only level 22. I think I'm a little over leveled for this, just a tiny bit over leveled. Be that. First off, any chests? Nope. Is that a chest? It's not a chest. Smart of them to actually lock me from doing literally anything on an elevator. Usually when they let you do things on elevators, it can lead to some bugs or glitches, like falling through the elevator. So it's more of them to just like lock you off from doing literally anything. Gonga. I am surprised. I thought it was gonna make me do like a little mini game. All right. Let's see. What is waiting for me at the end of this database? The data bots. Definitely not treasure chests. Treasure chests are not waiting for me in this place. <laughs> or maybe she's watching from uh, far away. You know, you did mention that you said that you uh, thought you were being watched. Scar?、うん。Bro, I just got here. Please chill. Still need to read. Hey, who? Oh. Dragon Lady. Is this the reason why they told me I needed to be level 40? Indeed, he is level 40. Now, if I remember correctly, I fought him once before. Oh, whoops. That was kind of scary. I thought I was still gonna get hit.
seems like he's weakened. It's just intro skills. Oh, damn! I couldn't swap in time. Are you gonna do it again? Doesn't look like it. He parried me. I missed the dodge there. But he's almost dead. He's not dealing that much damage. Actually, he's barely dealing damage. There we go. I guess this is the reason why I would want to have some training with counters. But who do you use to counter when you can just brute force through the guy? Here we go. <laughs> oh, phase two? Scar ever a nightmare. I don't think so. I think I have two more people with me. Oh god! It's a grab. That's a very long grab. Give it a little bit of a heal. Switch back to her. Please hit. It didn't hit! No! F QTE What the oh that was a lot of damage Hey yo free damage Oops Oops was gonna hurt I didn't even notice that he was to that low HP and I was about to kill him. But at the very least it's nice, I finished him with Rover. <laughs> An illusion? Or it was, or that thing was just it pushing us out of like that little realm. Fine, Elysium. Brother. You're not the most like trustworthy person, you know? Like, you're sus as hell. What did you expect? I know that she's also very, very popular. That's like a wife with type of character. She also has a beauty mark right here. People love these beauty marks. Oguro. Oh, 
I mean, it's not like you could have hurt me, you know? You were damn weak, Scar. Step up your game. <laughs> Bicar hitting attacks are really cool, but they're all. I guess maybe the reason why he had like big hard hitting attacks was just uh, to be like a big tutorial boss and give other players like a chance to dodge the attacks and start learning how to play against bosses. Um, but it does make the fight really, really easy. They look kind of cool though, it's just like him charging for the attack and he's just going for it and it just, just does like this big thing. It was nice of them to also have them really telegraphed. Yeah. I have a feeling that he's gonna escape. I have a really, really think that he's just gonna end up escaping. Not gonna lie. The first meeting. でも、I see. So this is just things that happen without your like knowledge of, of like a player. This happened is in the in the life of like Rover, but it didn't happen in the life of like a player watching Rover kind of thing. And, and no wonder it's just like the waifu of waifus for some people. Damn she pretty. <laughs> And for them to just like, I don't have how to play on. Please give me a second. I need to speak. <laughs> and them giving her like some sort of like bluish silver hair and putting her against the light of like the moon. It's just like, that's pretty good. Makes her look prettier. Uh, one of the things that I still don't understand. No better waifu than Changli though. Ah yes, perhaps. Perhaps she's very much a very mommy kind of character. She's the uh she seems more of like the vanilla, the vanilla waifu. Here's a question that I still have. I do know that these three options actually make you progress through the story, but I still do not understand what this option means. Why is it, it why is it different? What's so special about this icon? The tutorials don't tell you about it. It makes me want to click it, but I'm also very scared. Mm, probably not with Fractidus. Probably the Sentinel. Yeah. Because if if the emergency was Fraxidus, then we wouldn't be the ones meeting up with Scar. It seems like Scar was like the, the side emergency that was happening. I'm gonna guess that the reason that the Yapsen is gone is also one of the reasons as to why they're waging war against like the tacit discords currently and they're having like a tough time against them because they don't have the protection of the sentinel Jue. 
Held captive by Fractidus. Hmm. So it's not dead. Like I said, the light of the moonlight works wonders with her and make her, her like even prettier and make this like a, a special moment between Rover and Jin Jinchi. Jinchi? Jinchi? It should be Jinchi. しかしそれと同時に要は現況を突き止めることができました。うん。はい。フラクト氏ですが、悲鳴がもたらす技は。アドバンスのアラメント。その観察であるスカーは3つの目的を持っています。1つ目は脅迫者の移行調査及び勧
Okay, so do the discords in general come from negative human emotions? Is that what they are? Is that their lore? Or they gain power from it? Yeah, and I'm linking, linking this hero from this legend or this record to Rover. So the question right now is if, if that's just like a, I don't know, an exaggerated tale or if that really did happen and Rover was part of that and just he just lost. He, she, depending on what type of character you choose, uh, just decided to just, like ended up losing their memories. And I don't know. I don't know what that was like at the intro. I'm pretty, um, they probably haven't explained much about it since we're still at the very, very early stages of the game. And they're right now, they're just like setting the groundwork for, uh, or uh, like at 1.0, they were setting the groundwork for like the story of like what's going on, but like exposing you to the story of like the world. And later on, you're going to start to just unravel the secrets that are happening like outside the world. Uh, what the hell is going on with the Threnothians? Or whatever, Threnothian? Threnothian, yeah. Um, and all the things that are happening in general. Why are the tacit discords in this world? Why are they a menace? Things like that. What's creating them? Hmm. I really like her eyes. Like her eyelashes. Hmm. Yeah, I think I saw it. Like the dragon itself, Jue. I can't remember what else I was I supposedly watched on that scene. I can't remember. You tell Yinsi about the fragmented memories you were able to remember. Hmm. In the past, okay? In other words, in other words, I love you. Go on. Yes, but I'm special. Oh. Okay. Okay.百年近く同じ要望を保ち続ける宣言はありません。でも時間のことよりも他に気になることがあります。Hmm. I think I'm more curious about this. I don't really care much about who I was at the, um in the past, and I'll probably end up finding out later on in the story but how did he end up losing his memories and who the hell was it that showed up on the intro cutscene norfall barons also, I don't think... I wonder if I'm going to end up learning more about the other like countries since 2.0 is going to introduce a new one. Are there going to be hints of it in the story, in the side quest? By NPCs? Because I don't think I've heard anything about them yet. Or maybe I heard like a little bit about them and I just completely forgot uh, of like that information. Yeah. 
It's a lot of questions. I really just have way too many questions. A lot of them might be answered later on. Mm, hopefully. ヨガできることはこれくらいしかありません。もちろん、今週の力になっていただけるのなら、それに越したことはないのですが、あなたも自分の過去を知りたいという気持ちを利用したくはありません。うん。今週の人々は世の民である。自分の民を守るお務めを
Did something happen? Oh, by the way, is today like your your free day of work? New share. Hey, yo! Clippity clappity. A new share is always great. Mm. You have four days off this week? Damn, that's good. Did you get... Now, another question. Did you get it? a gamer share or did you get an office share? You seem pay time off time? Ah. Hmm. It's a cheaper office chair. I mean, as long as you're comfy, that's what matters the most. It can be it can be a cheap anything. It doesn't really matter. As long as it's comfy and it's better than what you had before, nothing else matters. I mean, I think my the chair that I currently have, I mean, it wasn't cheap. Definitely. It cost me a, a bit of money. But uh, it isn't like the highest quality thing it's not a herman miller but it is comfy i mean i really wish i could get a herman miller but those things are so damn expensive and that's it i'm done with him take him away beat his ass I had a gaming chair before I moved there, and it was so freaking comfy I could recline in it and get a full eight hours of sleep. Mm, yeah, I've heard about gaming chairs that they can be really, real comfy, but I've also heard a lot of people say that they're like not the best in terms of like, you know, for ergonomics. Forever Scar? I'm the main character, and I'm about to be that Threnothian sass. You know it. You know, I actually bought this chair because it had like a reclining feature and it also has like a, a whatchamacallit, a footrest. But because I don't have much space in my room, I've never been able to actually use it, which kind of sucks. But I do want to try sleeping on my chair at the very least once. I don't know, just like put some ASMR and just like chill. Or like watch a stream or you know people that do like the watch alongs uh like you know uh arcane is coming out i don't know if you know of arcane you probably do you know it's super popular why would you not know of it arcane season two is coming out this weekend so i mean i'd love to just like use the, the reclining feature of the share and just like chill and be on like a watch in that series Oh。以上。俺からの誠意溢れる回答だ。ま、とんだ茶番だったけれど。お前ら何を教えたって何も変わらない。But it's too late to change the course of history. He didn't mention this when he was talking about Jue. That because Jue can actually see the future and we can correct the future to make it better for us, it has affected his plans all this time. So now that he, he kidnaps it, he can do whatever the heck he wants. And now it's going to be way harder to correct the future. Hmm. 
俺からも一つ質問させてくれ。うん。核の失踪は俺たちの仕業。お前らはそう信じ込んでる。でもよ、そんな単純な真相は物語としては二流だ。I like his fractions. A very nice. 何が言いたい聞きたいかならおいで、レインさん。Oh, totally not suspicious at all. Oh, my darkin, you see. You can also be in some. Okay. What's going to happen? So, no, oh, yeah. Ega, sorry to mock you. Oh, but there's more. これが各自らが下したように決められた運命だとしたら未来を司さる存在である妻子がお前らを見捨てたその事実が何を意味するか明白だとは思うけど俺たちはただやがて燃え盛る大火に変わるたねりに薪をくべてやっただけのこと So a disaster is coming, do we already knew of this? And、he never told the magistrate. That's what I'm gaining from this little exchange. That's card. <laughs> okay, dude. <laughs> oh! と肩を並べるべき黒ヤギだ。新世界へとたどり、その地を開拓する権利を持ち合わせて、なくした過去を完全に取り戻すとき、お前は俺たちの仲間になる。うん。その未来に俺は関係を。Just a very odd entity。いつでもお前の席を用意している。平和漂白者。俺はその時を心待ちにするとしよう。And that is <laughs> after the interrogation, Scar is put in jail. He didn't escape. Okay, I was a hundred, a thousand percent expecting him to escape immediately. Sister. Where's the trust? Do you not trust in me? Please. Kakudansurutamino Mm. The bad thing is that dad can probably make this whole like the city or country way too dependent on Jue. Norfolk Barons. Hmm. I'll be fine though. 
夜も承知しております。何かお手伝いできればよいのですが。うん。ブラックショアという組織を。あ、あ、あ。I have。I have。from the little information that I know。of one point three。Do you guys very less affair when it comes to interacting with the city itself? Ah, I see. Membership process and members who keep their identities hidden. Wait, maybe I don't know. It's saying that it's an organization, so maybe I don't really know what the Black Shores is. So now I know that it's an organization, and I remember seeing it getting mentioned at the very least once or twice when I watched somebody play through like 1.3. But I still didn't see enough of 1.3 to actually just like, I don't know. Link information together to like spoil myself. Mm. The moon and the Thernothians. You learn more about the shores in the 1.3 story?、Mm. I bet. I bet. Just, just probably the one they were all talking about. I mean, after all, if a Thernotian is gonna be spawning and wrecking havoc, you know, for an organization that is trying to just like do their own thing, it might be on their best interest to just like not have everything plunged into chaos. Maybe. I don't know. You know, I'm very much do not know much about the game, so I might be talking about my ass, as usual. But who knows? I always have fun just like thinking about theories. And the Black Shores may reward your try during this time. As in finding them? Memories? Flashback? Flashback. Oh, uh. oh. <laughs> oh, would you look at that? It's more lore. <laughs> All right, but Jinsi, what does not have a deep connection to my past at this moment? Literally, everything is connected to me currently. <laughs> you is connected to me. The Black Church is not connected to me. Scarborough is saying I'm connected to them. The Fracti Fractidus? Fractidus. Bro is saying I'm connected to Fractidus. I'm literally connected to everything. Hmm. Like、traits of hair that she has. So probably traits of hair that I kind of want, like in my character. Maybe more. I don't really want blue in my hair. Okay. 
they're definitely going to say something that I shouldn't be hearing. Or not. Oh! Uh-huh. Here's the character that you've been talking about. Mm-hmm. 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 Oh. It definitely looks like the leadership of this country is just made of two wives, the vanilla wife and the mummy wife. Hey, I just beat his ass by myself, okay? his own like little realm actually maybe i didn't beat him by myself but i did fight him really well okay i can handle myself i'll be fine there's something about her that just kind of like makes me feel very suspicious of her Maybe it's something about her mannerism. Oh, Changli, this, this, this is her, right? That was literally Jinsu's lab dogs. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> okay, that, that, second, that second word there just like explains way more. <laughs> How about their little dark uh, relationship? <laughs> Mm, and I'm guessing this meetup is what leads her into becoming a playable character. Yep, and then you become playable. Yep. That I will have to fight it one day, a fight that will shape Shinso's future. But at the same time, if I remember correctly, she uses him as a uh, when she attacks. So something else must happen on the story. Maybe it is not going to be a battle to the death. Maybe. ガクトの対談で感じた違和感それと彼が残したメッセージ薄々気づいてはいましたが疑問の息を出ることはありませんでしたがどう最後に感じた核の居場所はどこ上昇さんですメンフェルメントあの山は今でも時が止まっております
Ominous. ただこれは本州の運命に関わることなので失敗は絶対に許されません。Perhaps the bigger goal is just ending the war. And helping Jue is a side objective. そのしかし、ヨガやるべきことは変わりません。本州に従う。霊院の役目を全うするだけ。So her answer is pretty much, I will end up fighting him if I must fight him. It will not stop me from defending the city. And I'm terrible at this. <laughs> I understood nothing from what she said. Okay, I like the way that she said that. It's it's not on the subtitles, but the they definitely should have added that onto the uh, the English subtitles. I shall be a pawn in your hand. Please use me well, Jinsi. Right, not only is she mummy wife, she's also mummy. In general. <laughs> And so, the plot thickens. Ah, uh, the strong human spirit and feed off of the collapse. Well, if you come in this shit, but I can't make another turn on the better than another one. I didn't read. Act 5 unlocked. Cookie chance of various activities in guidebook. Claim. What is this? Weekly challenges. Oh, yeah, I already fought this thing. It wasn't that tough. Uh, if possible, I do want to do as many events as po uh, as possible. Wuthering exploration. Oh, give me a second.
Looks like my time has come. <laughs> I actually did a stream for a lot longer than I was supposed to. I was supposed to end like an hour ago, but I did want to finish at the very least that story because the plot thickens. And now I'm on Act 5 of WUWA. I'll definitely be playing more WUWA in the future. I do want to catch up to it. And uh, yeah, I do want to catch up to it. I want to know about the Black Shore. I want to know more about Shorekeeper. Uh, which I'm going to guess because of her name and the fact that the other organization is called Black Shore that they're going to have us some sort of like big connection, probably. But yeah, I got to leave real quick uh, because I'm no longer alone. Dun, dun, dun. So yeah, uh, that was a little fun. Playing a little like Wuwa, finding like a boss fight and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, see you there. Thank you for coming. Um, and Arrow, thank you for coming as well. For chilling with me for a while until you went know, to sleep. And Dreamless, also, thank you very much for being here. And I'm gonna end up heading out. I need to leave.